With a mission focused on making sure children and families have essential items, the holidays are a trying time for nonprofit Katie's Closet. We help about 55,000 kids a year right now. Katie's Closet has shops set up inside 87 schools across southern New Hampshire and Massachusetts. Kids in need can pick up clothing and more free of charge. All of the tops are hanging, all the bottoms are folded, your jeans and sweats and shorts. We have, you know, big buckets of toiletries where kids access everything from soap, shampoo, toothpaste, toothbrush, feminine product, which is really, really essential right now. Those items do more than just ease a financial burden. It removes a stigma that can be crippling for some. When a child's wearing ill-fitting shoes and ill-fitting clothes and or not enough clothes, um, it's pretty devastating. You know, clothing is the most visible sign of poverty and children are the most sensitive about how they look. While distribution of items hasn't been negatively impacted during the pandemic, Katie's Closet says demand for their service has more than doubled. If you experience, you know, a, an illness or a layoff, um, the, you know, the first thing that you do is make sure you protect your home. You want to make sure you can pay your rent or you can keep, you know, your roof overhead. The next thing you try to do is protect your food uh, and your ability to get food. So anything else goes to the wayside. If you would like to make a donation to Katie's Closet, find the link to this story on our website. Mike Cherry, WMUR News 9.